Tippy tippy top top cream of the crop crop we got them all right here Hello and welcome on my glass Tyler right now snow goggle Tyler and this is my buddy sunglass Rob we just want to tell you what our roundup for just top picks of snow goggles for the season of 21 22 and stick around we're going to talk about it winter is coming winter is here i'm excited oh it's so good so uh before we get into the nitty-gritty in each one of these goggles individually just some things that all of these share in common and really things that you should be looking for in top tier goggles like the ones that would make it in our top picks list uh, foam, triple layer foam is super important. It is going to have a layer for rigidity and uh, maintaining form, a layer for ventilation, and then a layer for comfort and moisture wicking to help with fogging. Obviously ventilation while we're talking fogging is super important because if your goggles fog up, it kind of defe defeats the purpose of having yeah, goggles. Yeah, fogging is no fun. Fogging is the war. We use all the best ammunition we have, and venting is one of the things that all these brands do really, really well. These are the best goggles, so they're all going to be the best at anti-fog as well. But all of these also have really heavy-duty, really high-tech anti-fog coatings on the inside of the lenses. They all have their own version of it, their own name for it, but they're all amazing. And there's one trick with all of them that you should know is the less you play with it the better so if your goggles are dirty on the inside clean them but if they're not dirty don't excessively like mess with it because that coating in there is a little bit sensitive so uh just a little tip for you a little bonus tip in there for you so and if they yeah. ever get wet let it air dry yes don't wipe it yeah air drying goggles is the best way to go anyway yeah, yeah that's right uh, another thing that's good obviously helmet compatibility i feel like we've gotten past the it's it's not cool to wear helmets thing because it's cool to keep your brain working normally and so helmet compatibility is something you want to look for and you will find in all of these goggles and what that looks like is an adjustable strap and that silicone bead to keep it s sticking to the helmet yeah, you want that silicone in there because if it's not in there, well, these all have it, but if it's not in there, the uh, strap could slide a little bit on the finish of the helmet, even if it's matte or shiny. So they all have that silicone bead. And if you're not wearing a helmet, which we suggest you obviously wear a helmet, it doesn't hurt you at all. If, so yeah. it's, it's just a bonus. It's a nice thing to have. Absolutely. Yeah. And lens tech is very important. You want to be able to see the snow as well as you possibly can. You want to have the ins and outs be as obvious as possible when you're riding down the mountain as fast as you possibly can. So all of these have fantastic top tier lens techs, tint technologies, but even more important, at least for us RX wearers, Prescription insert. You can get all of these in prescription. You don't have to jam your really nice high-end eyeglasses inside of a goggle anymore. If contacts don't work for you in cold, at speed, at elevation, which for a lot of people they don't, you get dry eyes. The insert works amazingly well. And also a lot of people just go without their prescription and they're oh, going downhill idea. fast on sticks do and it's just dangerous. So um, <laughs> the prescription insert is works really well. We have our own anti-fog coating for it. So, um, you know, Sport RX, the RX is prescription. We're here to help you see better, help you get the best goggles possible. So don't forget you can get that insert. Should we start talking about goggles finally? Let's start talking about goggles finally. Before we get into that, if you are ready to order at the end of this, don't forget about Sport RX and definitely don't forget about our See Better Guarantee because with that you're never stuck with something you don't like or doesn't work for you have as long as 45 days with them to figure that out even if you get them in prescription we'll take care of you just reach out to us also we have opticians who'd love to help you get it right the first time so you can always reach out to us we'd love to hear from you it's like the micro machine man pick a goggle what's <laughs> are you gonna go you're I'll, gonna go I'll first my, my favorite goggle first the m4 i knew he was gonna pick that and one and an m4 has been my favorite since we saw it uh that year at outdoor retailer yeah, i mean as, can, how can before, it not be your favorite it is such an amazing goggle it has been my go-to for years it doesn't hurt that it has the easiest lens interchange mechanism on the market with just magnets super strong magnets you can do it with gloves on you have little grip points here to keep the lenses smudge free amazing ventilation also what about it, that new perceived lens and that perceived lens tech is incredible and they have so many different color available options in terms of light conditions they'll cater to everything and such an amazing he's about to get really excited face mask system here they call it their mfi magnetic face mask integration 
best face mask setup you could possibly hope for. You don't have to jam anything under the foam. It connects with magnets, so you can pull it off super easily, even without looking, even with gloves on. Super easy, helps to keep you, prevent you from cold. This season that we're in still with, you know, being concerned with catching a virus, this is gonna be you know, a better step against that. It really is just all through an amazing goggle. This is the toric version, which means that it's not spherical, it's not cylindrical, it's kind of the best of both worlds. This goggle is also available in cylindrical, but what's amazing is that it's the same chassis, so you can have both types of lenses in just the one chassis. Nice, all right, I love that goggle. I'm gonna go with a new favorite of mine. They're all like my babies. I love everything. I love goggles in general and glasses, but I'm kind of in love with this new Spy Marauder Elite. Uh, the colorway, uh, for me, I just love everything gray, so this is just amazing. Um, I, but I'm loving the venting on top. Uh, Tyler was telling us earlier that it's really meant for the snowpack. It really helps with that. It's super, super rad. Works amazing with the prescription insert. But they have a really cool interchangeable system. Um, Tyler's better with the technical stuff than I am. What's that called again? They call it Deadbolt. Deadbolt. The deadbolt locking system. And it does really feel like it locks into place. Like, it's a good name. It's solid for sure. So there are some people who, and I mentioned there being only magnets for the M4, that some people think that that's not enough. It totally is, in my opinion, for the M4 for sure, but you don't have to worry about that with this because it's, it's magnet security. and it's a lock. Yeah, it's really nice. So, uh, and happy lenses. I love happy lenses on the snow. Just a great lens technology as well. A lot of cool colors available. And I just love this. I just love the way it looks. It's, it's rimless. It's, uh, I mean, I'm, I'm, it's beautiful. I'm, I'm almost Huge speechless, yeah. which rarely happens. Huge oh. lens. I'm a big guy. I like big goggles. And also a toric lens on that guy. Very, very cool. Uh, Tyler, pick one. There's so many. So next, let's just go from the front. We have Ooh. this Smith Squad Mag. So the Squad has been super popular, especially with the sensibilities of the younger kids out there. Uh, really cool cylindrical design, which everyone still seems to be loving, at least the, the youth these days. And they took that amazing goggle and they made it even better by making a magnetic lens interchange. And so you can swap lenses very easily. Yeah, it's super rad and uh, secure and just, just a great pair of goggles. I love those. Another thing to note that they do differently than most other goggle companies is this strap system where it unlocks. This can make it a little easier when you're working with a helmet. Uh, some people love it, some people hate it. Yeah, there's also a helmet um, compatibility like insert thing where it kind of makes extends them a little bit if you need them to be bigger too. So there's that extra option as well. There you go. Really cool, straightforward goggle. Chroma Pop is an amazing lens technology. I mean, there's so much good stuff. It's like we just keep saying how good everything is, but this is the best seven. So of yeah. course they're all the best. Another amazing one is uh, the Zeal Lookout. This thing is really cool because they basically married two technologies that were from their better goggles. One was the hatchet, which had this observation deck, which basically means the goggles are kind of like automatically tilted a little bit this way. So they're really thin here and really thick here. And that's basically kind of forcing the goggle to tilt down a little bit. So you have better optics looking downhill, which is mostly what we're doing when we're on the mountain, hopefully. Right. For right? you opticians out there, yeah. pantoscopic tilt. Yeah, and then they have the rail lock system. Is that, did I call it right? You did, you Yeah, got so it. that's how it interchanges. It has a, just unclips out there and then it just, you follow the little guidelines and it just slides back in. But something that Zeal does that a lot of brands don't do is a photochroma, photochromatic or what some people refer to as transitions or automatic lenses, which basically means they get lighter and darker according to how sunny or not sunny it is out there. So it changes for you. This one still does come with two sets of lenses. One's a lighter lens for overcast days, but this first lens is pretty automatic and will work in a lot of different conditions. So that's pretty it's, rad. I like these. Yeah, all of the colorways come with a low light lens, which is the sky blue mm -hmm. mirror. But then you have the option of getting either an automatic or if you don't like the, the, the transitions or the photochromic lenses, you do have options that are more fixed tint, but they do that photochromic lens very, very well. So why don't we go next to the Oakley's Rob? The Flight Deck XMM, no names, so many names for this goggle. Now it's called the Flight Deck M. They come in a couple of sizes. There's the old Flight Deck, which is 
used to be called the XL, which is now called the L. The only thing wrong with these goggles is the naming convention. Yeah. Sorry, Oakley. <laughs> You're confusing us all. Um, but this is the medium size. There's also a larger size that fits me really well. Tyler can pull off either one, even though he's got a smaller head, because they just kind of look oversized. Um, but this is Oakley's kind of first goggle that had a full rimless look all lens, uh, all spherical, super high optics. These do not come with two sets of lenses. I think it's the only pair out here that does not come with two sets of lenses. So the pros of that is it's not uh, as expensive. The cons of that is you don't automatically get two sets of lenses for different light conditions, but with the prism lens technology, you really almost don't need it as much because these lenses work so well in so many different types of lighting conditions. You can interchange the lens if you need to, if you want to. You can order a second set of lenses. It is physically possible to switch them in and out. They're not like glued in place or anything, but they don't have like a quick, easy snap in and out system like all of these have. Which I think probably is a bonus for some people. I've mm -hmm. worked with a lot of people who say, I do not want to change my lens, I don't care. And so then you don't have to pay for another lens that you're never going to use anyway. Yeah, just one set of lenses and yeah. you're good to go. And that, that one set of lens, I think if you get them in the Jade or the Torch, or the, um, what am I missing, the Sapphire. Mm -hmm. Those three lenses, I've tested them out in like super bright days or also like white out days. It works pretty well. Like it's We've done lens good. guides as well. Yeah. So you can always check those out if you're curious to know what would be the best option for you. Or opticians, another call out to us, give us a call. Why don't we talk about this Dragon? Yeah, the this X2. Is this has been a personal favorite of, favorite of mine for a long time because they work so well with our inserts and they also have a very easy interchangeable system. I actually can do it um, while I'm wearing them. It's almost easier for me to do it while I'm wearing them, but you just unlock them like that. They come out, you put them back in, you lock them back in and it just works uh, really, really well and then it just locks back in there. So, and these do come with two sets of lenses and you get the Luma lens on there. Uh, that's their better lens technology. What I like about these, some people are worried about this, the um, top of the goggles, they're mostly all foam. And if it's really heavy day, a uh, really wet day, it can get wet. Uh, these have this armor, this plastic armor around it. So it keeps them dry longer. So on really powdery days, it's actually really cool. They call it armored venting and it is very nice. Also bonus is it does work even better than with our insert because these little prongs up here have a little more support, a little yeah, more structure. It's a great insert setup. So uh, Dragon X2, it's been around a few seasons for sure, but still a great seller here. We still love them and they come in some really fun colors as well. So you can I always look to Dragon for something like that. Yeah, I think that's kind of a selling point. If a goggle has been around for a long time, it obviously it's is working. working. Yeah. It's doing tried, its job. Tried and true. Last but not least. The Rexy winner. The Rexy winner. Yeah. So this is the WM3. It's another Anon. Uh, I, I wish that this didn't have to be the case, but it is the only goggle on this table, even though this is not a gender specific video that is designed specifically with women in mind. Yeah, it's a women's goggle from the ground up for women's face shapes, different cheekbone styles, different head shape contours. So really designed specifically for women. And a lot of times goggles are unisex because they're just smaller and now it's a woman's goggle. But this one is not only a little bit smaller, but specifically designed designed for women and you still get the MFI, which Tyler told you earlier how much he loves it and how amazing it is. Um, just a wonderful goggle. This one is cylindrical, Magnatech, some really, really cool colorways, works awesome with our um, insert that Perceive Lens Technologies, the newer version of high-tech lenses from Anon, and I'm in love with Perceive, it's just fantastic. One more thing about the MFI, I'll talk about how cool it is forever and ever, is uh, Anon sells additional MFI compatible things, like you can get a whole friggin' sweatshirt. Yeah. Hoodie sweatshirt that has this. It's really, really a cool tech, and uh, you can get them in different thicknesses too. Really cold weather, yep. warmer weather. If you just want the sun or the wind protection, so it's just a super, super it's amazing modular yes. system. And sorry, the M as in uh, WM3 is because they use that same Magnatech technology for lens interchange. So super simple, amazing goggle. Wow, that was a lot of Woo. amazingness, a lot of really rad goggles, a lot of energy going out right here because we just love all these goggles. You can't go wrong if you get any one of these. You can't go wrong if you get them from SportRx, and you can't go wrong if you get them in prescription because we have the See Better Guarantee, which Tyler already talked about, so I'll stop boring you about all that stuff. We love you, thank you so much for watching. Tyler, say something cool. 
See what I did? Thanks. <laughs> All right, thank, thank you so, so much, much for watching, watching this if you video. Enjoyed if you want this more video, content, it's right down throw there Throw a thumbs up, that'll help us out. You can find relevant videos over here. If you're ready to shop any of these below. awesome styles, you can hit the Shop Now button right here, super uh, fast and easy. Instagram. Also, really good content here on our social media outlets. I think you should check it out. I think you'll like it.